Uh, Governor Matt Bevan has even tried to cut our teachers' pensions, uh, for not only for active teachers, but for teachers that are already retired. Pensions are extremely important to our teachers. First of all, I worked 15 years before becoming a teacher and paid into Social Security. As a teacher, you don't pay into Social Security, you only pay into your pension. So thanks to the WPO Act of Mitch McConnell, we only see about 30% of what we paid into Social Security. So when I retire, my pension is what I'm going to have. If I'm married to someone who's not a teacher, you only draw about 30% of their Social Security. So this is our livelihood, and this is the only way they're going to get quality teachers in the future. Who wants to work and fight for your pension? I mean, I mean, we can't do it without our community. They, our teachers are our backbone of our schools and take care of all the kids. And thankfully, here in Eastern Kentucky, we do have their support. Bevan slogan is that he is just getting started. Uh, he's just getting started, all right, on the Alec playbook that's handed down from the Koch brothers without a state interest. He has repealed prevailing wages for work hands that I represent, and uh, this is detrimental to their uh, putting food on their table. When you cut two-thirds of a man's paycheck out, and he's got a house payment, a truck payment, putting tars on a vehicle, and driving an air back and forth to work just one way, that hurts big time. Well, I, I hope that the people of the state of Kentucky can hear our voice, that, that they see that you know, the, the promises that, that Matt Bevins made you know, on the backs of school teachers and policemen and firemen social workers, construction workers. Um, and, and I hope that, that the people of Kentucky you know, send a clear signal to, to Matt Bevin and people like him. We are Kentucky. He is not. You know, and we're the ones that's putting the money back in the economy by paying taxes, buying vehicles. And, um, you know, he just, he just don't understand. He's not from here. He ain't never had on a pair of work boots in his life. He ain't never worked a construction job, as far as I know. They'd run him off the first day.